Hey everybody, I'm Joey from Smiling Bovine Ranch, and today we're going to take a look at uh, the new headquarters. We're still moving in, so everything's just kind of thrown randomly, but let's take a look. So this was the old... Ah. The old working facility that they used. So it's got an old squeeze chute with an old wooden lead up alley and stanchions. So this is where they used to work all the cows. We'll probably end up using this for all the kids' projects. Right now we've got some sheep and some bottle calves and a pig. This is the old original barn that's been here for longer than anybody so the owner told me that this barn was here when he bought the place back in the 70s Got hay storage and then this part my favorite part the tack room Through this door, then we got the feed room. Tons of wall hangings. Over here you got a bunch of holding pins. So when you receive cattle, you can put them in here. And we've been using this set of pins right here just for the horses when we catch them in the morning. We hold the horses here. They can go under the barn there. <laughs> So that's like, uh, that's, that is the pens off of the old barn that we first looked at. And so like I said, we'll put our kids' projects in there. Got some sheep, goat, some bottle calves, pig. I know our son is going to get some more goats here pretty quick. So we'll get that set up for them down there. This is the shop. And it's, this is the building that's really a disaster because we got early possession of this building the first, so everything just got thrown into this building. <laughs> Baby chicks. My notes. And this little building up here is the machine shed. So this is where we'll park all the equipment once we get it moved over here. Nice little place to just keep all the equipment out of the sun. This is the old shop, dirt floor barn. Right now it's kind of just storage for the moment, park feed truck in here. Eventually we have intentions of uh, cleaning this out real good. We gotta fix the saggy roof over there, get it picked up. Um, and we'll probably put stalls over here. That's the sawmill. We got other plans for that. That's, we'll probably get uh, some boards signed or sawed up and start working on repairs to the old barn and whatnot. And in here is so this is where we'll receive and ship calves, and this is the working facilities. So you got Hydraulic chute, set of scales, catwalk so that you can get up there. You got your lead up alley, you got a certain thing up there. 
Another big alley. You've got one, two, three sorting pins off of here. Your holding pins are, you got your two big holding pins there. So this is going to be the, the vet shack, so this is where we'll keep all the medicine and tags and all of the vaccinations everything. We'll end up putting a fridge in here, keep everything nice and cool. There's a heater in here so nothing freezes, sink so you can get cleaned up, and your working chute is right there. So just walk in here, get your stuff, and start working cows. Pretty nice room. attraction this is our feed barn it's got 250 head capacity of feed bunks so we could probably put a little bit more in there if they were smaller but that's what we're shooting for is 250 head if you had to lock them in here that's what you got room for you got two water tanks you got your clean outs on the end um, needs to be cleaned right now but Bunk. got a nice pin over here that's all woven wire and whatnot so the idea is you send them in here for a day or two to get them good and calm down and the lane here with bunks so that way you can get them good and calm before you kick them out into here but the idea is you put them in here for a couple days while they get good and calm then you can put them in through the barn and put them into that pin it's a, couple acre lot there that's got plenty of grass and there you can start rotating them through your pastures so that's a tour of the headquarters hopefully you'll continue to follow along make sure and follow us on all the social medias hit that bell icon like and subscribe